We got a little bit of rain, but it's fine. Maybe it'll be like London where it said it was gonna be raining every day, but it actually ended up being so beautiful. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel for today's video. As you can tell, we are kicking off a Paris vlog, but it's not like any other Paris vlog. It is a solo Paris trip, which was on my bucket list for this year. I wanted to travel somewhere that I'd been to before, so it's pretty familiar. I'm spending about a week in Paris on my own, and I'm just so excited to head back to one of my favorite cities. For this trip, I'm going to be bringing along my Monos luggage, so thank you so much to Monos for sponsoring this portion of the video. I'll be traveling with a large check-in because this time of the year, it's cold. I need sweaters, I need layers, I need coats, boots. It's really hard to do that with just a carry-on. But I'm so excited about the carry-on I'm traveling with because of this front compartment. None of my other carry-ons have this. This is going to be a game changer, especially for traveling solo and needing to work while I'm traveling. This front compartment fits up to a 16-inch laptop, which is exactly what I edit on. This is gonna be great for easily reaching in for my laptop, my cables, my Kindle, so I don't need to take up so much space and open my carry-on through that main compartment. This front compartment also has pockets where I can easily organize my chargers, such as my cables for charging my laptop, my phone, and even plugging in my headphones if I wanna watch a movie on the flight. Mono suitcases are dent resistant, impact friendly, and features ultra sturdy telescopic handle. It has a TSA approved lock, whisper quiet wheels, vegan leather details, and all premium materials. Luckily, Marco and I have a basement where we can easily put our luggages away when we're not traveling, but if you are tight on space, these luggages do nest into each other, which makes it really easy for storage. Monos comes in tons of different colors, so it makes it really easy for you to find what best fits your personal style. I love these lighter shades, but understand that it might not be for everyone because you're worried about scuffs or anything happening while it's traveling. Luckily, Monos does come with these cleaners, which makes it really easy to buff out scuffs on your luggage that happens while it's traveling. But I also do have this Monos luggage cover, which is really great for check-ins because Things do happen when you don't have your luggage with you, but this is a great way to help prevent any additional scuffs from happening while it's in transit. Like this luggage cover, Monos has tons of accessories and bags such as totes and backpacks so you can just complete your travel set. They make great gifts for the holiday season, whether it's for yourself, a partner, or someone in your family, a friend. Monos is doing a special promotion this month and all you have to do is click my link down below where you can get up to 30% off your order. I need to be at the airport in about 24 hours, so let's get packing. Thank you to Monos for sponsoring this portion of the video and let's get to Paris. appearance I just got off the flight but we need to do a room tour because this is insane <laughs> just kind of getting settled in. I landed around 7 a.m. and things took kind of long at the airport, nearly an hour and then traffic was almost two hours getting into the city. Just a heads up in case you were trying to land first thing in the morning on a weekday. But I made it, I checked in. I'm staying at the Shangri-La Paris and this hotel is so beautiful. Marco and I have been here before, but just to get a tour of the property. We didn't get a chance to stay, but here I am with literally the most beautiful view of the Eiffel Tower I've ever had through all of my stays in Paris and Marco isn't here. Hopefully next time we can come back. This hotel is so beautiful and I just spent the morning getting settled in. They had breakfast waiting for me, which was so sweet. A bit rainy this morning, but I'm just excited to wander and explore. I don't know anyone here, 
So I'm really just on my own for the next week. And I chose Paris because I've been here a few times. I'm familiar with the places that I wanna go and the areas I wanna walk around, but I feel okay wandering the city. The trees are peak fall foliage tones. I like the overcast. I like the slightly chilly weather. Bit of a rainy week, but feels nice and cozy. So let's go out and explore. Good morning, it is Wednesday and I am about to head out, going to the Scaparelli showroom today, so I'm so excited. I need to head down to the lobby to meet with some of the team from Shangri-La Paris. And I think I'll go and get a coffee somewhere. I have my Scaparelli equipment, so I'm wearing my one Scaparelli piece. I also got these Kate boots from Farfetch and I'm so excited to wear them. Today is a beautiful day. Yesterday was super rainy. I also just landed, so very lazy day. Today, I feel a little bit more productive. After I got back last night, I had a spa night and then relaxed and chilled for the evening. Great sleep, almost forgot where I was this morning. I woke up and I was like, where am I? And it was just the most insane view of the Eiffel Tower. So going to head out now. Um, I'll show you my outfit and then We'll get going. So we have the Scaparelli tee, my trusty old rag and bone jeans that are so comfy. We have the Kate boots on, I don't know if you can see that, there it is. And then my Celine coat. Also taking out the little Kelly today. Okay.
just finished my Scaparelli appointment and picked up a little souvenir. Scaparelli is definitely like the most like, adventurous I go in terms of style, but I really love what I picked up. You can never sleep in traffic Cause living steady panic I know cause I try asking Now I see through your habits Just like gadgets You tell me with the another bath another little pierre escargot moment doing a little mask doing this pore detox just in this midsection going to edit then call it night just enjoy the evening bed is all nice and cozy i didn't unpack much so i feel like packing will be easy but going to just watch my drama and take in the view while i still have it
morning, everyone. It is my final morning in this hotel room. I'm switching hotels today, but this has been such an incredible stay at Shangri-La Paris with probably the best view I've ever had from any hotel that I've stayed in here. I had such a chill and laid back morning and I loved it. It is literally pouring out. The skies are so gray. There's not a glimpse of sun. There's like a mist that's covering the Eiffel Tower. Got a lot of work done this morning. Also got to just relax, enjoy my breakfast and also just pack up. Feel totally well rested. Because I have been to Paris a few times, I don't feel the need to have a packed schedule, which is why this is a really great solo trip. I was able to really prioritize like the things I did want to take off my list for this trip. That's it for my little update. I'll see you guys when I get to my next hotel and take it from there. And this is one of the first properties that I ever stayed at in Paris. And they recently did a renovation. So let's do a tour. into that store because there was a dog that I wanted to pet. I ended up buying stuff because the dog was so cute. And as soon as I walked in the door, the dog said hello to me. So obviously I had to buy something. C'est pas pour moi donc. Et c'est comme je peux pour appeler le plat, mais moi je mets juste à dire. Est-ce que vous voulez boire quelque chose avec ceci Oui, moi je vais commencer par un verre de. de. Sweet home. Do it again. 
Bye, lady. with you guys but yesterday i moved hotels got a bag from this place let me show you don't know if I'm, it's the vibe today maybe i'm gonna wear it later because it's a nice sunny day it's like in a burgundy color i wanted a burgundy bag looks brown right now but it is a burgundy reddish shade actually perfectly matches my nails it's called a croissant bag which i thought was very cute to commemorate this solo trip me justifying any of my purchases as commemorating the solo trip. I wanted a burgundy bag, but I knew I didn't want to go with any of the premier designers. I really love this silhouette. I was actually looking at a bag from the row that's kind of similar. Obviously, you just didn't want to spend that much money. I mean, this bag is made of Napa leather, so it is still quite pricey. This was about a thousand euros, and they have a smaller size, a bigger size, and they come in tons of different colors and variations of it. So highly recommend checking them out if you are in Paris. Great, casual, and easy style. Let me back up. I think this looks better with my black coat. I'm meeting a friend for coffee at Recto Verso. I'm trying to be extra productive today while I have daylight on my side. See you later. Small city thinking, I get why you left. Small minded people, sure know how to drink. sweet treat hello everyone it is around 3 30 just got back to the room spent the morning with jessica who i follow on instagram she follows me and she's also here by herself in paris so we met up for coffee this morning at recto verso and then it started to pour so we were taking shelter at caret and then i went to another department store i'm not gonna butcher the name so the name is there there hasn't been too many sunny days i think i had just one other full sunny day that was i think my second day in paris and so i didn't want to spend the afternoon at the department store i know tomorrow is like 80 percent rain so i'll do all of my little department store souvenir shopping tomorrow i wanted to check out the little shops that are along the river Take a nice little stroll back to the hotel i think it was about a 15 minute walk not bad but now charging my phone because it's dying. I'm gonna do a little outfit change and then going to head back out while the sun is out. So that's the plan. Um, did a lot more walking today compared to yesterday, but need to take a little quick recharge break, maybe about 
20, 30 minutes and then head back out. Want to go grab a crepe from one of my favorite spots that's right by here. See you in a bit. did an outfit change. I went out for a little bit to just shoot photos of my outfit. I literally brought my tripod out, but it's fine. I've seen multiple people like walking around with tripods. So I feel like a lot of people usually do a solo Paris trip and it's like, why not? And it's actually been really fun. But then I'm also meeting people here, which is also really fun. So I have one last full day tomorrow. It is going to be raining. So we're probably going to be department store heavy tomorrow. That's it. I'm going to just remove my makeup, edit. I need to sleep at a decent hour because last night I only slept for four. And yeah, I can't be doing that. Should I go back for that Max Mara coat tomorrow? I don't know. Celine coat, got my Le Mer bag, and Aritzia pants. I'm gonna wear my M. Jemmy boots that I've just beat up over the years because it's raining. So let's get going. I'm gonna bring a little extra tote bag for me because I have to go to the market. And final day in Paris, let's go. I'll be there at the after party. Show up looking like a zombie. It don't matter, nobody stop me. I'll be there, just tell me when Damn I'm a long way home, at a split road Gotta make a choice, do I sober up? Am I trying to keep it going to be continued Or am I trying to lose good and I came over now? I don't think I want to leave at a tough week Gotta realize this is what I need Don't got the time to be counting sheep It's too late, I'm in too deep don't wanna contemplate, overcomplicate this And I made my choice, wanna see what's going on I'll be there at the after party Show up looking like a zombie It don't matter, nobody stop me I'll be there, I'll be there I'll be there at the after party Show up looking like a zombie Just wanna see what's going on. What's going on? I'll be there at the after party. Show up looking like a zombie. It don't matter, nobody stop me. I'll be there, I'll be there. I'll be there at the after party. Show up looking like a zombie. It don't matter, nobody stop me. I'll be there, just tell me Christmas market and it was actually so much fun. Well, we didn't, we did two of the rides. We did the swing thing, 
which was a lot scarier than I anticipated. And we also went on the Ferris wheel and perfect timing because the exact time that we were on the Ferris wheel was on the hour. So the Eiffel Tower was sparkling and it was just so beautiful. And I, it was the perfect ending to this trip. All right, I'm just like removing all of my jewelry and unwinding because we need to pack. And I did shop a lot more than I thought I was going to. Number one, that Max Mara coat. This one is not bad because it's flat and it's a great travel bag. So I'm very happy that I got this. The other things are fairly small actually. So maybe I'll be fine. I just got to really finesse the packing situation. My little towels, the things I got for weight, oh my gosh. Number one, a baguette toy. This one is so cute. Definitely so big for Wade, but imagine this in his mouth. It has the slots for treats, so it's a bit of a sniff toy. I got him this scarf, so it just like, just like on his neck. And then this adorable little mitt that I'm not really shopping Chanel anymore. At least in terms of handbags, like if I wanted to add a Chanel bag to my collection, I would be going vintage and not like a classic club or anything. I feel like it would be a fun vintage, but look at their holiday packaging. It is literally so beautiful, so pretty. So this, my lovely audience, is my holiday giveaway. And so I am going to mention the rules for this giveaway in Wade's fan club, which is my broadcast channel on Instagram. But all the information will be there because I would love for this to go to someone who has been subscribed for a long time or has been following for a long time and I'm just so appreciative because I wouldn't be on this trip without you guys. And you're a big part of how my life has changed in so many ways in the past years. And so I just always want you to know how grateful I am for you all. So I had a special request from Felicia and Camille who were here the last Paris trip in February when Marco and I were here. Uh, Felicia asked for these, which are these caramel candies, chocolate covered bears i don't know i got caught up as i was on the line you know how they get you with those little things and i saw a lot of people grabbing them so i was like okay maybe good sign she also wanted some white chocolate with raspberry and i found exactly that extra dark chocolate and milk chocolate with salted caramel for camille and that looked really good so i got myself one we also wanted this truffle thing. She wanted another brand before, but it was completely sold out. So I grabbed this one. That's it. I'm going to try and pack. Thank you for joining me for my little haul. My plans for tonight are to pack, have a hot bath because my feet are killing me. Nice shower, crawl into bed. New episode of Castaway Diva. So we'll be watching that. And then I'm gonna have an early breakfast, like as early as possible, so I can really enjoy the morning in the room. And it's supposed to be a clear day. So yeah, just going to enjoy the balcony. And that's all for me. Good night, everyone. Talk to you tomorrow. I had so much fun on this trip. I enjoyed my own company. I was able to meet up with a friend. I was able to make a new friend and I just really loved this experience of really being on my own schedule and pace in one of my favorite cities. Very impressed with my monos because everything fit. That's all for me. So once again, thank you so much for all of your love and support because without you all, I wouldn't be able to do what I do and I'm just, so forever thankful and grateful for that. See you guys in the next video.